Hey guys, this is Gabin once again, and today we'll be working on simultaneous equations. Simultaneous equations. So you can see it's equations, no equation. Well, why? Because we are solving two equations at the same time. Well, so we are solving two equations at the same time, and we are trying to find the value of well, both x and y at the same time. However, with this solving simultaneous equations, there are a few ways that you could do it. However, today we'll be looking at one of the methods that we have got. So elimination method or elimination method. Basically, the idea of elimination method is we are trying to eliminate um, one premier. Right? So we are trying to eliminate one premier and finding the other value. Right? So let's get started um, now. You can see for this one, we've got x plus y, x plus 3y equals 10 and the other equation is x plus y equals 4. Right? So let's solve this the way you would solve this because you can see here we have got plus plus and we have got x and x right so as i said we are eliminating one of um, the variables so to eliminate one of the variable we could just subtract we subtract this right we subtract the first um the second equation from the first one and when you do that then you have um you have x minus x is zero right zero x plus so here we have plus plus but then because it's minus so we take 3y minus so we take 3y minus 1y so here there is like 1y so that it becomes um plus 2y equals and then 10 minus 4 equals 6 right 6 so therefore therefore y equals 3 uh, so this is our first value uh, our first value is y equals 3 now we can substitute we can substitute substitute this value y equals 3 into one of the equations uh, so let's substitute in into um the first equation into so this is 1 and this is 2 into 1 then what you have is you have um you have x plus three times three equals ten right? Right. so therefore x x is equal to x plus nine equals ten and so x is equal to um when you minus subtract nine on both sides, you get 10 minus, 10 minus nine is just one. Huh? So x equals one. Huh? Now we can conclude, therefore, x equals um, one and y equals three. Huh? So that's it guys for this example as you could see so we eliminate one of the um we eliminate one of the variable x because we uh, we subtract them if you add you could get two x but then it will be hard but then we subtract one x from the other which will give us zero and then we end up with y solving for y we got three and substitute the value of three into the first equation and uh, we got x equals one you could check here think about this so if um x equals one one plus one one plus one times y which is three one plus three equals four right? and then here if you do the same thing you get a value right so let's have a look at the next example and see how well we can do this all right guys so this is our second example right second example let's look at this second example so second example you can see we've got five x minus two y equals eleven three x plus um two y equals thirteen right so we are solving this we are trying to find the value of x and y that could solve both of these equations at the same time right so as we are using the um, as, um, elimination method let's do the same trick that we used before now we realize that it will be hard to try to eliminate x in this particular example now our idea because we have got two here and two here let's try to eliminate the y's values now in this case because they have opposite sign we are not going to subtract however we are going to add them right add them because we know plus and minus we just cancel each other because they have the same um, numbers in front, right? So now, 5x plus 3x is 8x, right? 8x. 
2 minus 2y plus 2y just 0 plus 0y because what is um 11 plus sub 13 is 24 uh, so therefore you end up with x equals um 24 which will give us divide by 8 on both sides it give us x equals um 3 uh, so this is our value for x uh. now let's do the same trick before this equation one and this two so you then substitute uh, x equals 3 into equation any equation and let's do equation 2 this time into 2 then when you do that you have um, 3 times 3 plus 2y is equal 13 right so well, equals 13 and then you have um 9 plus 2y equals 13 subtract 9 on the both side you have 2y equals uh, this will become um, 4 because 13 minus 9 is 4 so and therefore you have um, your y equals to divide by 2 on both side y equals 3 uh, so this is our value of y and then we could conclude that therefore x will equal to 3 and y is equal to 2 uh, and again you could check substituting this value in so 3 times 3 here 9 plus 2 times um, 2 4 13 and you could do the same thing in that particular example and then have those value all right guys um thank you so much for watching our videos uh, we were doing uh, we were solving simultaneous equations using elimination method and like share comment and remember to subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so i will see you in the next video thank you